What's up guys, in today's video I'm going to be showing you guys how to boost your FPS and significantly lower your input delay with this one tool. Now this FPS tool that I'm going to be showing you guys is really good. The results that came from this program, it is impressive. It made my computer silky smooth and I really hope the results are good for you guys too. But I do want you guys to keep in mind that if this does not work for you, that is because your computer is not meant for tweaking and it will only lower your performance. But this should work for most of you guys, especially low end PC players out there. And I just want to say thank you guys for tweeting. 200 subs i appreciate the support you guys have been giving me recently and um yeah let's get straight into the video okay guys so what you guys want to do is go to my link in the description and it will lead you to this website now what you guys want to do is create an account because you will need an account when you download the program and you open it so i recommend making an account on this website and then pressing download and then once you have done that you basically just want to go to your search bar type in home i already have it open as you see in my taskbar but you basically just want to open it from there when you have it downloaded and you will be greeted with all these tweaks but if you're opening for the first time like most of you guys will be you will be greeted with like a, you know you might have to sign in immediately and once you signed in after opening it it will give you a message saying it's not guaranteed that your performance will be boosted which is like i said in the intro that it varies from computer to computer it's different from every computer but it should work for most of you guys like i said and once you've done that you will be greeted with all this now what i recommend doing before anything is coming up here where it says system restore and then pressing create system restore naming it to anything like for instance i'll name it to scythe for this video i cannot spell all right so like that just pretty simple straightforward and once it's finished um you can go back to right here to the home and go back to these optimizations now basically this program provides you with a description for every tweak here so you know like what it does and what it can do and it even says power hungry which is important for laptops because it will increase your gpu temperature if you have more power coming from your computer and i don't recommend this option for laptop players by the way because this is power throttling and you guys need power throttling because temperatures are bad on laptop and it will break your component so i don't recommend turning this off but other than that the rest of these are really good like such as game gaming optimizations optimized windows time resolution this makes your delay significantly less it is really good um they even have disabled cortana all of these and i want you guys to keep in mind that you guys will be having limited tweaks if you're on the free version the paid version is like six dollars a month it's not that much uh but it's worth it um as you see i have all the tweaks that are pretty good using right now i'm using them right now and it's really good like my computer feels smooth like silky smooth right now just showing you guys this but uh i do recommend you guys pay six dollars a month for the premium because you will be able to get as much tweaks as possible from this program and it's it's really worth it like i literally played fortnite after enabling these tweaks and my delay was significantly less and my fps was better and it felt way smoother i can do more stuff in the game so i do recommend you guys pay for the premium but if you do have like the limited and you can't pay for the premium the ones that i would tell you that you should enable the most is um let's see if you guys need to optimize your uh, NVIDIA or AMD CD, it's even for AMD too, you know, optimizes the settings for you. Um, so if you guys need that, I do recommend putting optimize AMD settings right here. And if you're on NVIDIA, do the same thing for NVIDIA. It's an option uh, right here, general optimizations, or they, I think they have like a another one too here somewhere. I just can't find it, but yeah, it is really good. And I do recommend using it. Um, the most tweaks you should use, like I said, those are the two. And then you should use maybe optimized power plan and disable hibernation, stuff like that. And optimize IO operations. Just just read through all of these and see what benefits the most, basically. And just put them on if you're on the free version. But if you're on the paid one, I recommend doing as much as you can after reading all of them. But it does significantly lower your input delay. It is really good. Like my computer feels so smooth just moving my mouse right now. And also there's another option right here next to optimization. If you go to boost up, there's more options such as junk cleaner, optimized defrag drives, stuff like that. It is really good to run on your computer because you do need it. Um, junk cleaner will really significantly improve your delay. Optimized defrag drives is really good too. This will make your drive run faster and smoothly when you play games. And it even says right here the description of it, just like how the other tweaks did. And these are really good. 
um i do recommend doing all of these because these do it will it could actually really benefit you if you're on low end pc it would really benefit your fps a lot so i do recommend doing all of these um after doing the other tweaks of course right here after doing them but uh they also got a section right here where it says game settings now this is very important because this will optimize your you know just if you leave it right here like just press activate it will really optimize your game settings like it'll make your game settings really good it will boost your fps basically and give you the most performance you can get out of the game which is what you want and it will significantly you know lower your input delay too while doing that but um yeah that's pretty much it and if you guys have any issues with these uh tweaks you can always you know that's why i told you create a restart point right here at first you can just go back click uh, the one you made the newest one and basically you'll just go back well not from here but if you don't know how to go uh if you guys don't know how to go to your restart point just go to your search bar and press create restore point right here you go to system restore press next and you click on the newest one that you made from the program and you press next and then you'll um restore your things if it messes up anything after the tweaks but it really shouldn't it should benefit most of you guys especially low npc players this program is really good if you guys enjoyed the video make sure you guys hit the subscribe button and hit the notification bell for more videos i will be putting out more tweaks very soon so make sure you guys stay tuned i will be posting tweaks a lot on my channel so if you guys you know enjoy tweaks and stuff make sure you subscribe for that reason hit the notification bell but um yeah peace out